Hey guys, it's Sonya coming to you live tonight. It is day 15 of the 30 paint a piece of furniture a day challenge. It's late. Yeah, it's like really, really late. There are other people in the building that I'm in, so I'm trying to like talk really low. How's everybody doing tonight? I'm getting ready to gear up to, uh, yeah, to knock out this little ottoman here. I actually got two in a set at the local thrift store for $18. So basically nine bucks a piece. And uh, it's got some really, really not cool fabric on it, but that's okay because we're gonna use these as an example tonight to show you that yes, just like you paint wood, you can also paint furniture, okay? So we're gonna talk fabric. about that a little bit. What did I say? Furniture. You can paint furniture. <laughs> you can paint furniture, you can paint wood. You can paint anything you want, okay? You can paint your husband, your wife. So yeah, so uh, true story, yes, our paint does stick to fabric. How's everybody out there doing tonight? Talk to me as you guys log on. Tell me what you're up to. It's Sonya and Matt tag teaming it tonight um, for day 15 of our Paint a Piece of Furniture Day Challenge. And you guys know what that means. There is a giveaway. There's also some painting going down and some chit chat, okay? We love to make things beautiful on a budget. What's everybody saying? So Angela Gravely Lane says, yes. finally, laughed out loud. <laughs> Sherry's checking in from Cleveland. Nice. Uh, Kelly Weiler says, hi, Sonia. Barbara Jock says, it's been a long day for you. Yes, it has been a long day for us, okay? Yeah, but we still probably got two or three more hours left to go. We, yeah, we'll, we'll be here for just a little bit, okay? So we got paint orders to go out. But I'm yeah. super excited because I have to tell you guys that um, Linda. we have painted Linda, a, Linda, a set of furniture, Linda. a set of cabinets. My God, I can't talk right. A set of cabinets for the last 52 weeks. And for the first time in a year, we are taking two weeks to not do any cabinets. We're taking a little bit of a break, and what's really cool is it'll give us time to really focus on things that you guys have been asking for, right? So I'm excited to be able to do that. So okay. here's the deal, real quick before I get started. Painting furniture, okay? So did you know that in order for a, um, like whether it's a repurposed store or like a new to you store, a thrift store, um, that they are supposed to spray their fabric. And so this is what your clue is going to be to make sure that they are in um, accordance with the law. Okay? At least in the state of Pennsylvania. What's that? At least in the state yeah. of Pennsylvania. In our state, here's the deal. So we have to be licensed in um, pay and also go through procedures if there's anything that we decide to sell in a store that has fabric on it. And I guess it's a way to control like, you know, like nasty things that can live in old things like furniture that has fabric. And um, so what you're supposed to do is um, get a certain spray, it's called, what's it called? Microban? Microban, yeah. is that what it is? Mm -hmm. And then what we do is we spray it all over, okay? So I got these from a thrift store, and then what you're supposed to do, the store is supposed to attach a yellow tag, and you can see on here it says, date it was sanitized was July 28th, okay? So that's what it tells me on here. So just a little clue when you're out and about, this should yeah, make you feel it. good, okay? Mm -hmm. should make you feel good. All right, so here's the deal. We're gonna paint fabric tonight, and I've got a couple things to talk to you guys about because you guys have been asking me all about this. So yes, you can paint your fabric. I don't have to pop this off. I'm gonna go just make it work as is, okay? So here's what I'm gonna do first. I am going to wet my fabric, okay? So I love to have uh, little spray bottles. I keep them handy for my glaze, but the thing is you want to um, basically help your fabric get ready to accept the paint, okay? So if you ever um, like worried about painting fabric and it being like cracking and um, just, you know, not so, not so comfy, that sort of stuff. This is one thing that you can do to help avoid cracks and um, just really, really stiff um, fabric, okay? So the color I'm gonna put on top of this here, I'm thinking about doing like on the wood portion, thinking about doing an antique lace. And then I'm thinking about doing this color here to basically paint the fabric, which really, when you're painting fabric, I'm gonna show you how I do it, but basically, in your mind, you want to think it, think about it like your fabric is being stained by the paint, okay? And I'll show you how to do that in just a second. So this for the wood portions, and I'm thinking distressed. I'm thinking this for the fabric portion, and then once it dries, I'm going to totally put a stencil on it. I'm going to totally stencil the fabric. So what do you guys think of that? Good combo? Good combo? What's everybody saying? Well, everybody's saying because we're trying to be super we quiet. We are being quiet. Here. Very quiet we got people who live up above our shop and so mm. it's so late we're trying to be very um Galen you know, was eating respectful. peanut butter and being peanut butter ice cream and waiting well i was <laughs> checking in from wyoming 
<clears throat> Jennifer is checking in from Springfield, Ooh. Springtown, Texas. Oh. Um, I hope you are able to stay away. We're, Nancy, we're yes. just getting warmed up. <laughs> okay, so here's what I do. I've got a tray put down. Are you catching this? Yeah. I've got a tray put down. Seriously, guys, I pay, like, to get 200 of these. I use them all the time. So it's a great way to, like, you know, as a, like, you know, if you spill paint, it's just nice for all kinds of reasons. But anyway, so what I'm going to do here is what you do. I'm going to dip my paintbrush first, okay, and get it wet. I've got the fabric wet. And then what I'm going to do, so wet paintbrush, and actually I'm going to do it vice no, versa. Yeah, we got to be quiet. I'm gonna. There's no roll tie tonight. <laughs> no Eli gold tonight. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna dip my brush in the paint. I'm gonna dip my brush in the water, and then I'm gonna go ahead and put it on. Okay, and remember, the fabric is already um, damp. Okay, yeah. so that's how you get it, so that you don't have your fabric cracking. So a douse right here. You get you picking this up. In here, in here. Dip, dip, so dip, 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 dip. obviously, I dip, have dip, lots dip, dip, dip. of um, <laughs> dip, dip, dip. You're funny. I have lots of different um, colors of the paint that we make because I always end up with the little jars that not that don't quite fill up. So if you're gonna do this, rather than kind of like uh, get water in your paint, maybe you could dip yours out of. I said dip, right? That's because you've been dip. saying dip, dip, and dip. Okay. And you see what's happening? Can you, are you, is the camera picking that up? What you're doing is really, really uh, just getting your, your paint all watered down, okay? And it is going to be like a stain, okay? Which is so, so cool. So you could mix your paint half and half if you wanted to go that route. But my favorite way is basically, because you're going pretty much half and half. So a dip into the paint, dip, a dip, dip, dip into dip, the dip. water. Dip, 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 and dip, dip. there you go. And then you're going to put it on, okay? Shabby chip dip, brush. Dip, dip, you guys dip, dip, know dip, dip. that's my go-to brush. I don't get anything crazy. You know what I mean? I'm going to go all the way over it, here. It helps. The, the fabric's still going to be stiff a little bit when the paint dries. But yeah, it will know. really help. But it's not going to crack, okay? So if you were to um, use, um, I don't know, like some other paints and you just and put like a paint directly onto the fabric, it will go ahead and just crack because the paint hardens. In this way, we're basically staining the fabric, okay? Because we've got the, we've went ahead and we've damped the fabric. We've made it damp. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's like a uh, song. It is. Isn't it? Yeah. yeah, exactly. Oh, that's so funny. All right, so dip, dip. So what's everybody up to tonight? They're watching we're, you. It's, it's late, right? It's yes. totally late. Not not for uh, not, not for, for us. California. And not for us either. And not for us because no, we're we're crazy we people. We stay yeah, late. We don't sleep. Yeah, we're cyborgs. Um. So anyway, Lisa wants to know. She's been bugging yes. us for that Ray stencil. Yeah. So we gotta figure out when maybe we're tomorrow do that. night's the night. We'll see Ooh, if I Lisa. get my supplies together. Lisa, or Lisa tomorrow, tomorrow might night. be a lucky night. Yeah, I've also got a rocker that I really want to um, to go ahead and paint the fabric on. And today I did, just did not get a chance to retrieve it from storage. So you know what? We're going with these ottomans that I had, but I kind of liked it. Because, yes, you're correct, Jennifer. Because it had the um, the wooden parts, and you guys know anything wood, I'm gonna love the paint. Okay, so here's the deal: what happens? Wood. Can you is see that? Good. This is the color it was before. Wood is good. You guys see in the gray that I put on it? I see it. So basically, right. I'm right. staining it. Hopefully the camera Paint picks it up gray. good. Exactly. So here's what would happen now. We're, we would need to let this dry, okay? So we, I'm gonna go on and continue to work around the frame, but this is now no, wet no, and we're we need not, to let it soak up, okay? We're not We're not tired, we're being quiet. Yes, yes. Because because our tenants We upstairs, share a building with other yeah, people. They're yeah. sleeping, so we're being quiet. Because we're, we're probably normal people who, um, yeah. you know, get up early and, and have yes. jobs in the morning. So we are, we're just trying to be. Yeah, we're just to trying to be quiet. Be good neighbors, be good neighbors. So Did you here, paint an armchair? Yes, yes. You can oh yeah, that yeah, that'd be so pretty. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. We'll do another fabric, um, fabric uh, project as well, okay? So here's what we've done, guys. We've put the gray on. Here's what's gonna happen. And the hell is, here's what you do. You're gonna put the gray on just like this here and you're going to let it sit overnight so it dries. When you come back in the morning, and I'll show you, you guys tomorrow will be able to see me finish up this project. But when you come back in the morning, this is gonna be dry. You can then take a sand pad and go over it, and what that's gonna do is just kind of loosen it up again, you know, like kind of get the fabric moving a little bit. It's gonna be a stain fabric, but this is what you're gonna to use to kind of like really just get it moving, and that's gonna help you um, not to not have stiff fabric, right? 
And then now that that's dry, you would do the very same coat again. You do the dip, the half, basically the one dip of the paint, the one dip of the water, and you put on a second coat. So I'd recommend doing two coats because your first coat is really going to set it up. And then your second coat is, is where you want to be. And it's going to really make it nice and vivid. And then you could totally stencil it, which I'm going to, I'm going to do a stencil one here tomorrow, but I want, I'm going to get these two ready tonight with fabric on them and get the fabric dyed and um, do the second coat. And then when I come on tomorrow to do our next project, I'll actually do a quick check in on this one. Yes, Maria, so let's, let's it go is ahead. smoky coal. Yep. So, um, again, my quiet oh, voice is like the like the yeah, emperor it's, it's, from Star Wars. I don't know. You've got a scary <laughs> quiet voice. Oh, that's so funny. So remember, spray it down first. That's going to be important, okay? Because you want to get the fabric ready to accept the paint. We are using paint, yes. Yep, we're using paint. There you go. And you're spraying me. Oh, did it feel good? Not really. Did I miss you? Did I miss you? Or did uh, I wake you up? All right, so watch what I'm doing here. I'm going to show them over here. So dip, one dip, dip in here. No, it has one to be dip one, in one here. Dip, 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 dip. And what's really cool is I'm going to get this started. Now here's the thing. Imagine if um, I'm going to paint this, paint the wood around it as well. But you guys know what I use if I want to like block off a piece of fabric that I don't want um, that I don't want paint to get onto. Like maybe this was a chair and the chair is, you want to leave the wood as is, but you just kind of want to redo the fabric. Believe it or not, I use saran wrap. You can, um, saran wrap is amazing because you can tuck down in behind fabric parts, you know, in behind handles. And like say for example, where your handles connect to the pad of your chair. So love um, handles, love handles, even yes. shares have love handles. Yep. You need to, you need to hurry up because if it hits midnight, you know, I'm going to turn into, into a, a pumpkin. pumpkin. Oh yeah. 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 Well, you know, we had to get our video in today, right? Yes. Did you guys see the, um, the project I did today as well on home talk today? We had a very busy day today. Um, but we did a, we did a, um, a table today on home talk. Did you guys see that? It was like the, we did a teal version of that stencil that we used um, the other night. Do you guys like it? Do you have a favorite? Actually, uh, just show Sandy, them. Um, Ask them which do they uh, like, the teal or the, uh, the, the red? The teal or the red. You can show uh, them. Sandy, I would imagine so. We can't speak to other paints, but okay. I know you're in, in Australia, so. Yeah, find something um, that might be a chalky style paint, okay? That's gonna be your best bet to do this sort of painted fabric with. You don't so. wanna go and just get like a, you don't want to go and get like a um, now you know, you're getting something from paint the, on the me. store. What? Your thing is See, I told you, you can too paint your husband if you really want to. Ooh, so look how nice that is. All right. Oh, Hi. Linda, what? you're not feeling good today. What's wrong, Linda? With Linda, is she Linda, not well? listen, listen. Oh, so nice, right? So remember, I'm going to, let's paint one so I can kind of show you at least what I'd like to do like to with See, the... You like the teal one over yeah, here? Yeah, and, and I apologize, but I'm seated, and this is the first time I've seated all day. Yeah. And I'm not moving. <laughs> so. It's okay. So y'all can suck it. <laughs> this, is, this is a good view, right? Uh, no, this okay. is smoky coal. It's, yeah. Well, I guess it is a grayish. It's a dark grayish. Huh. Okay, so remember, first coat goes on, so spray, do your half, basically one brush stroke of the paint, one brush stroke of the water. That keeps the ratio of basically half and half. You could also try to mix up in a jar the paint and the water, but I just prefer to do the brush, and the brush gets really nice and uh, wet, and maybe we'll just kind of spit it around and put it into the fabric, and then it's like a stain. So tomorrow I'm gonna come in, I'm gonna do a nice little buff, buff with a, um, not in the buff, but just do a buff in the, um, with the sand pad, and then I'll apply a second coat. I don't have to dampen it anymore, but I still would do my half and half ratio of my one dip, two dip, and go ahead and do the spin, okay? So then for the rest of it, so I'm really seeing this with, um, with antique lace. Let me kind of get up so I can see what I'm doing here. With antique lace. Now remember, this is where you use a saran wrap if you really wanted to. You could, like say for example, I wanted to paint this and I didn't want to get any paint on this part up here, I could take saran wrap and kind of like tuck it in all the way around. Make sense? Yeah. Ashley was looking for the uh, owl stencil today. She couldn't find it. Bobby owl. Lobby. Oh, sometimes they change them out. So maybe. Um, you should have told her before she went. Out. Well, I never know when I go down there because sometimes. Oh, you know. Sometimes you they know. bring them back and sometimes they. She uh, knows. They tell. 
Look online. In the world of Hobby Lobby, Sonia Whalen <laughs> oh, Miller knows. Oh, God, help me. <laughs> Seriously. All right, let's see here. Let Do you normally wet your brush when you paint wood? No. When you paint wood? No. No. no, no yeah, no. 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 I'm just doing a, this is just a, a chip brush. I'll see you, Sandra. But. She needs to go to bed. Sorry. Good night, girl. Get your beauty sleep. Mm. We'll be here in the morning. Mm. We'll be here in the morning. So I kind of just want to show you the color I'm going to use. And then imagine it with a stencil in the very, very center. I just think that's going to be beautiful. I think it. I think it. Oh, Riley's got the hiccups. Riley's got the hiccups right here. Yep. There you go. Pretty cool. So what do you think of the choice of colors? You guys like it? Imagine like a really cool stencil up here. Tomorrow night we're going to put one on because, yes, I will totally stencil fabric. You better believe it. And I'm just doing a dry brush here. I could fill this in with as much paint as I, if I want, but I'm just, um, I just want to lighten it up, right? Oh, now you're yawning again. Um, do you wet, uh, do you wet your fabric before the second coat? No, only the very first coat that you put on. That's your base. And so you want to wet your fabric um, at that point, okay? Let's see here. I might do a second coat of antique lace. I'm just throwing it on here real fast so you guys can kind of get the picture, right? Uh, the colors are... Antique Lace. Antique Lace. Yep, and Smoky Coal. And cold. Smoky Coal. Smoky Coal is cool, it, is cool because it's a gray one before we're done. <laughs> that has a... It's like yeah, a brown right. gray. And, uh, yeah, it's a brown gray. And it goes really, really good with wood tones. Cool. So, Erin just started painting her cabinets with midnight blue. Really? Oh, I hope you'll send me a she picture. She says she's loving the way it's turning out. Nice. Oh, that makes us happy. Yep. Very happy for you guys. Do you sand after a second coat? Uh, after the second coat? No, you don't have to. I probably wouldn't, and you don't have to seal either. Now, when you paint your fabric, of course, you're putting something on your fabric, right? So, um, this way is the best way to get it so that it's not like stiff and it's going to, like I say, crack but it will feel a little stiffer, right? So, but most people who are going to paint fabric chairs, the best ones to do that with are the ones you're planning to do for, just for decorative purposes, right? So maybe you wanna put a chair in the corner and you wanna put a really cool pillow on it um, and you found a really nice chair and you don't wanna reupholster it, then um, just get it as is, paint the seat of it, paint the arms of it, whatever you gotta do, the fabric, por fabric portions. Um, I love like the rocker that I have. I think I'm going to do it totally in an antique lace and make it like really, really cool, like shabby chic, very, very light and creamy. You know, I can totally see a pretty Felicia. pillow in it, like ruffled pillow. Felicia wants to know, yeah. would you leave the fabric after the stencil and be complete or do you seal the fabric? I leave it because remember, um, it's going to stick. It's not going to come off and <laughs> I don't want to put any sealer on it because sealer is made to go hard, and so I would just leave the. Oh, um, Jamie, I'm not tired. I got to be quiet because I don't want to make. I don't want to upset the people upstairs. Yes, yes. They might be cannibals. You never know. <laughs> you don't want to upset the people up there. Seriously, it's yes. it's like midnight where we are now, yeah. basically, and uh, we were coming back from our client's house, and all of a sudden this car like rips by, and it's playing Madonna. Um, Pop is it Papa Don't Preach? Is that the name of the yeah. song? Yeah, pop it out, preach. Yeah, well, so it was really funny. Kellyanne they... said, first time watcher, what a great couple and talent. Aww. Kellyanne, you're joining us on an off night because we yeah. gotta be quiet. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. In a world where you have we, to be quiet. We need like closed caption, <laughs> yes. okay? Yeah, yes. we need closed caption. Yes. Oh, what yes. is a good way to elevate your project for painting if you can't be on your old knees? Just um, put it on a desk. Yeah, put it on a desk, absolutely. Yes, we want to see pics of Aaron's or, cabinets as well. Yes, please. Before and um, after. If you even No, you like, do not sand after the second coat, Anna. Have you ever painted fa fabric for an art project? For what? For Is an art project. Me? Yeah. For an art project? Yeah, Have she, I ever painted for an art project? Yeah. She was thinking about using a drop cloth as my candidate for a large art project. Well, actually... Ooh, that's um, a great idea. Yeah, we have a friend who's a really good oil painter. He's like world class. And he... He paints on like painter tarps. Yeah, painter tarps, like twenty foot. He makes huge canvases. He builds them himself. Yeah, it's yeah. pretty crazy. That's great because yeah. When we look at my tarp down here, this is this is what I paint on. So you could go and 
um, you can get one of these. Are you showing it to them? I'm telling you. You could go and you could get one of these painter's tarps. That would yeah, be a really canvas. cool, um, this would be a really cool like class project. <laughs> can you imagine going and get one of these tarps? Honestly, they cost like about $10 and they're pretty big. I've cut this one in half. Um, sometimes I use them for literally tablecloths when I'm doing like paint parties and things like that. <laughs> but they absorb the fabric, real, the uh, paint really nice. So imagine if you did an entire wall that was a painter's tarp and all the little kitties, you know, painted a theme or did whatever you assigned them no to. Kid. Ain't no kid. So fun. Paint my wall. What? What are you talking about? <laughs> Linda, no. said, Linda said, yeah. uh, have they complained? Yes, they've complained. So. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Deb Shu, what's going on? How are you doing? So, anyways. Uh, Noelle shared. Leslie said, me too, Melody. So, anyway, so we're being, I feel like, uh, I feel like, I feel like we're in a tent and we should have a flashlight. No, you know what I feel like? No, what do you feel I like? I feel like, you know... We should be talking about... I, I feel like that... What? We're here in the wild. In Sonia. There's a Sonia with a paintbrush. <laughs> nice. You funny. Yeah. Oh, my God. Shh, Deb, don't yell. Deb, Deb, don't yell. Keep your voice down, trouble. people. Yes. Keep your voice down. Shh. Inside what about, voices. What about? Uh, did, you guys, did you guys ever have a teacher that said that you uh, you couldn't cheer, but you could do the silent cheer if there was something exciting that they told you about? I remember we had a teacher that would do what that. What are you talking? You couldn't about? make noise in the classroom, and so what would happen is that um, if they if he said something that was really cool and you wanted to go yeah, you'd have to go yeah. <laughs> Everybody would do silent cheer, right? My my teachers never uh, were cool enough. Really? To, yeah. We did, yeah, we did silent cheers. Yeah, you could We'd do patio cushions as well. Yes. Still no sound or that picture, cool. only messages and hearts. Nancy, what else do you need other messages and hearts? <laughs> just kidding, just kidding. All right, what do you think of that? What do you think of that, guys? Mm. Cute, right? Cute, cute, cute. I'm going to do the other one like it as well. And then, and then, tomorrow, I'll, when I do my project tomorrow, I'll like bring these back, bees, bring these babies back. We'll put the stencil on and we'll finish it up together so you can see what they came out like. Sound good? So Nancy Nine says, bucks each. Nancy says, I can't believe you have to whisper. Yes. We don't, well, we're in a building that's 200 years old. So let's say insulation didn't really exist. <laughs> so we were here this morning before we opened, probably about what, nine o'clock, eight or nine o'clock. And this they, is my new agent number yeah, right here. Yeah, they were having a spat. No, it was last night about 2 in the morning. They were having a spat, and we could, like, hear everything, you know? Juicy. It was juicy. Yeah, it was, it was like, better than uh, guiding light. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you guys ever hear, ever live anywhere where you hear things through the walls? Oh, yeah. This is what's going down here. Sharon, I believe I sent yours out already. I'd go look at it, but yeah, I'm pretty sure yours is out. So we've been sending out stuff left, right. Here's an idea. What? We've sent out, what, 200 boxes, over 250, 270 boxes so far? Right. In the last about five or six days. Right. So I got to go look. I can't wait for the new machine to get here so we can just put the tracking number in. Neither can we. And if you've noticed, it's me or Matt that write, that hand writes your label. Yes. If and, you can read it, um, it's hers. <laughs> if you can't read it, it's mine. So we can't wait either. So we can actually like print and you guys get a message. Like, I'm serious. Like it will change the world. <laughs> it will change it'll change our world, okay? But but that's the fun, right? How do you eat an elephant one bite at a time? So uh, this week we've, uh, yeah. Unless this, this the elephant, <laughs> unless the elephant's alive, and then he you. doesn't get at, and he's not happy. About it. Yeah. <laughs> so, anyway. Day by day. Yeah. Oh my my foot. Nobody's died, so it's all good. Uh, my foot, yeah, yeah. I can't sing because I gotta be quiet. So. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine that Matt has to be yes, quiet. Yes, and yours, yours uh, ship because. Remember with the name debate, that's why we were like the Susan one Bates? to laugh. Yes. Oh yeah. Yes, absolutely. Can you tell me about your paint, please? Uh what do no, you want no do? sanding, no priming. It has a chalky type finish. Sticks to everything. Uh metal, wood, uh, fabric. plastic, <laughs> fabric, glass, you name it. Your teeth. Um, yeah, it, 
it, it all works good. So, yeah. Did you guys see my picture I posted today? It even sticks to your nails. Did you see that one? Yeah, Can you yeah. imagine if I went into... Deb, she says she watches her neighbors fight. What, what, you wouldn't have to go out. You could just sit on your porch oh, with popcorn. Man. <laughs> we're, we're actually, Kelly and we're at our shop at uh, 111 South Market Street in Ligonia, Pennsylvania. The Joke Monkey Paint Shop. So... Can you guys see do they not ever watch your videos? No, they're not. They that probably kind. don't know what we do. They have no idea what they do. They just—they have no idea. I don't think what we do. Yeah, they—they—they they, they just know that we're the people that come in and like took their parking place and made them get work stuff on, out of the basement. That, and like work know, on godly hours. Yes, they probably so. think we're vampires. Yeah. They're probably up there with steaks and garlic oh, right now. You know what? Anybody seen the Burbs? You guys know the Burbs. <laughs> We're like the people in the basement, okay? They're probably like wondering what the heck we're doing and who yeah. we're talking to. Yeah, Serena? Yeah. No, they're, they're not watching. They're not watching. We don't think they are, so, anyhow. They're not watching. Howdy, neighbor. <laughs> Howdy, neighbor. Yeah, if they are watching. This are you is, showing us? Yeah, right, if, okay. if, if they are watching, it's going to be really awkward over the next few weeks. Awkward. I don't know when to do the dab, dab, dab. Monkey man Tomorrow in the house. Tomorrow we'll have extra dab. Yes. Yeah. Yes. yeah, absolutely. <laughs> yeah, well, we did all kinds. Of, I, like, dabbed myself out earlier. Did you hear all the dabbing I was doing this morning? Yeah. Holy smokes. Yeah, no kidding, right? Cool, Sherry. Oh, What's Sherry saying? Yeah, tomorrow, actually, since there is no cabinets, no, no contracting work, tomorrow is going to be all-day paint blitz. Yes. Yes, the post office is now going to hate us, too. They already hate us, but they're going to hate us more. Yes, absolutely. There you go. Uh, <laughs> oh, I can only imagine what that was, Dreyer. Okay. Uh, Jennifer Dreyer. Actually, we were at a hotel one time, and I, I think we ruined some kids for life, but that's a story for another time. Oh, my God. <laughs> What do you guys talk Terry about? Terry says, do we ever sleep? No, we never sleep. Terry, about? how long have you known us? Oh, you're welcome, Susan. What's Susan so, saying? Oh, that is stuff. Yeah. Yeah. I enjoy Susan, watching. do you run a, run a hoping, hotel? Hoping you guys make, uh, hoping make it up to your shop this week. Oh, yeah, yeah, Bobby. Yeah, yeah. yeah we're Well, we'll be here. Tonight. We'll be here. Because typically, yes. you would only, um, for me, anyhow, you'd only find me here usually on a Saturday because I'm working on cabinets for the week. But like I said, Don't I got you two say, oh my God, man. weeks. Well, yeah, yeah, Deb, I'm saying the same thing to myself, girl. Yeah, um, well, since... I know this, what that was in response to. <laughs> since that's after dark, you know. It's after dark. It's late night, you know. Anybody watch Big Brother tonight? Oh. I was at my client's house and they were watching Big Brother and I was so jealous. So jealous. Susan Wren, yes. Listen, yeah, hear I'm, the clock? I'm sure yours... You hear the clock? Yeah, it's midnight. It's midnight. Uh oh, I'm pumpkin. Susan Rand, yeah, I'm pretty sure yours has went out as well. Like I said, we've sent... Yeah, I remember I remember Susan Wren because I said maybe she invented the Wren system. This is what I do. Remember the Wren? I think it's the hair system, right? Is that yeah. what it is? Oh, God. So, yeah, this is how I remember yeah. names and stuff. Yes. I, like, put weird stuff with it like that. So, yeah. Doesn't that so, kill yeah, your so back? I have to put part? my projects on the table. Oh, um, here? Um, no. Yeah, Actually, you know, painting is a great thing because Sonia, since she's been painting... Has grown an inch, believe it or not. The doctors yeah. admit. Yeah, I, I am like growing in height, and I think it's because I'm stretching to like roll cabinets and stretch really high. And um, yeah, so the Susan last Susan says, No, I, I don't have a motel, but I am your neighbor. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's yeah. funny. All right, what do you think? Could you guys introduce them yourselves by taking them at Bass of the Paint? Trust me. Matt took them beer. I took them a. 30 pack of beer because they wouldn't just just to be nice yeah to be nice yeah, yeah. not paint people no i don't so. think so i don't think so have you ever switched between sonia the cameraman and matt the painter i think we should no do that. i saw no. that might have been you i saw right that earlier i think that's a brilliant idea you got two chances of that jack and yeah and jack just left town right i knew you were gonna say that We'll convince him one of these days, right? Sleeps for sissies, right? Yes. <laughs> yes. Seriously, I think so I went to bed last night want... at like oh. 2 o'clock in the morning. Isn't that terrible? Yeah, I think I finally got to sleep maybe 4 and then I was up. I feel like when I go like home, like I want to put like yeah. on TV and watch TV for a little bit. And um, I don't know. I feel like um, I need less and less sleep. Like, why is that? 
There's no room. There's no room to stencil on my arms. They're already full there, Maria. All right. <laughs> she said, "Do you ever want to stencil my arm just to add to some of my ink?" Let me show you something. Oh yeah, there you go. Oh my gosh, I think I set on my foot. Um, let me show you guys the stencil I have in mind. Show them. Deborah right wants to know why we're talking. Everybody, tell her it's why we're talking. So, oh yeah, gosh. because because our neighbors are upstairs. We're in a 200 year old building, and mm -hmm. you can hear everything. And when I mean everything. I mean everything. Maybe we'll have to do a live broadcast when, you know, like an after dark broadcast when everything is happening. Yes. Yes. <laughs> the, the junk owls. Actually, Sonia would probably have done that. Yes. What? What? She said you should call to yourselves the junk owls because we're up late. Junk owls. Yes. Junk I'm owls. definitely a night owl. Yes. This is, um, let me see if I can find it. There's a stencil I was thinking about using. Huh. And I'm playing. Yeah. So I told him that when it gets juicy up there one night, we're going to go live, and we're just going to let it roll. We're going to start our own big brother? Yeah. Jamie, restart your stuff, girl. So, uh, nice. Where's it go to? I have to think here. Let me show you. I know Somebody I shared the link for the owl, by the way. Hey, oh, good for you guys. You guys are awesome. Um, yeah, hopefully that helps somebody out. Give me a second here. Give me a second. Give me a second. Okay. Okay, it's after midnight, and she's like wandering off somewhere while I'm sitting here talking to you guys. So, show you. so how you guys been? <laughs> what you doing? I got paint on there, so I need to hit that with a little more gray. It's okay. Okay. All right. It's okay. All right. But look at this here. You can actually kind of envision this because the, the stencil is actually gray itself. Ow. But take a look at this. This is one of the stencils oh. I have in my shop here for sale, and it's one of my favorite ones to use. It's Don't touch. Don't touch. Like that. Look. But do you see it? You're touching. Do you see it? Imagine that on here. So tomorrow night we'll put these on here, and I can just kind of lay it there so you can see it. Can you okay, visualize it? Good morning. Yeah, Light, morning, morning. Gray, and then we're gonna. I'm gonna distress the dark wood, and uh, I think it's gonna be da bomb. I think they're awake. Uh oh, it's all your fault now. Now you done it. You done it. I'm gonna add a little bit more. Uh, a little bit more gray right there. I might be able to actually, it seems like it's pretty dark now, but yeah, so tomorrow when I come in, this will be dry, and um, I can add a second layer, and you can kind of see already, do you see what happens when you put the second layer on? The first layer is already soaking in, do you see that like square that I just yeah. painted? So it's going to continue to intensify, but what I want to do is let the first layer sit, do a little sand, and then I'm going to go at it with the second, so... All right, I just want to fix that part where I managed to get some. No, we can't. We, we still got to do our own thing. What's that? Linda, I blame you. You woke him up. Lena <laughs> 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 said, as like in your terms, yes, yes. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I say, there's people that, like, there's a lot of activity out at night. I was surprised. But what's tonight? It's what, Tuesday? Yeah, yeah. it's Tuesday. You'd be surprised. Okay. Apparently, people have busy lives. So, anyway, this is what we're doing. Is 50 a shade lighter or darker? It's lighter. lighter. That's why it's the 50th shade. It's a very, very light, romantic yes. gray. Romantic? Very, very light. Yeah. There was, shade there was nothing romantic, romantic? about 50 shade gray. It is. So. When you think romantic painted spaces, you think lights and creams and whites and light grays. This is a very light gray. It's awesome. Like, I'm totally, like, paint a dresser and I can see a sheer kind of blowing in the window. You know what I'm talking about? See, you know what was shocking? Lacy, a little bit of ruffle. I, I, was, enjoying, so I was enjoying that 50 yeah. shades of gray till I got to page 217. And then I realized it was an adult graphic novel. It was scary. I was, I felt dirty. I didn't read it. Where did you read that to? Oh, I didn't say I read it. What are you talking about? <laughs> Mm, mm, mm. All right, so we're going to log off here. How are you going to seal the claw, or will you need to? No, I won't need to. I'll show you how it works well, out tomorrow. you can scotch guard it, too. Because remember, this check. is really wet right now, but you don't want to make it too, too wet. So I've misted it. I've misted it. Is that a word? Missed it? Yeah, I misted it. That sounds just so weird to say. Maybe it's getting really late. But anyway, spray it down, and then um, <laughs> put your, your paint water mix we got to let this dry, okay? Because this is the first layer and it's stained the fabric. And now tomorrow we're going to build on top of that. We're going to add a really cool stencil. And then I'm just going to tell you, for nine bucks each, it's going to be awesome. Marina says, so she, think? Marina says she was in Walmart earlier and yeah. she was watching the Kitchen and then she totally forgot what she went in for. <laughs> I always do that. I always do that. 
And I think they purposely like, well, I know they do, right? They make Kelly it go Sheet. all over the place and you totally forget. And then yeah. you buy stuff that you don't even need. Kelly Sheets says the yes. book was better than the movie. How would you know, you dirty monkey? Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> but did hear that the kids should be home when we do watch it. <laughs> No, I don't think, I think it's no. the other way, so. Yeah, 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 that's probably what she meant. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, I, but I don't know, this This is just how I feel. I've seen seen many, many um, collections of the book, because there's a couple, right, in the series, and I see them at yard sales, mm. and part of me is like, I should pick this up and read this, mm. because there's a lot of people who read it, and I kind of like to know what I'm missing out on, right? Anybody right. else feel that way? Yeah. But then there's a part of me as well going, I don't know if I want to touch this. I don't know if I want to take this home. Anyway, just a thought. Just a thought. All right. So All I've right. never taken them home. So, so right. what's the deal? Do I got to pick a winner? Yeah, pick a winner. All right. Uh, totally pick a winner. I gotta, that means I got to stand up. Okay. All right. I'm going to put this over here. My Lord, what are those sounds you're making? Those are my knees. That's not normal. All right. All right. Touch it. Don't, don't trip up. Don't trip up. Touch it. Yeah. So you could even turn a fan on, like, you know what I mean? Because you've got wet fabric and you want it to dry, right? Imagine you've got a beach towel. So uh, give it some, uh, yeah. some airy, okay. aerate it. All right, tonight's yeah, winner, tonight's winner. Yes. Tonight's winner. Yes. Is okay. Lori May. Lori May, Lori are you still on? Lori May. Lori. Lori oh, Lori's May. been around a lot. Lori May. She, I saw her today, too. She was Yes, crazy. Lori May. She's probably being good and went to bed. Lori May. Dirty monkey, paint monkey. <laughs> the naughty monkey. The naughty monkey. Oh, there's Lori. Is she here? Yeah. Oh, Lori, you know the deal. Just message us your stuff. Yes. So, um, Tell me what color you want, okay? Yeah. yeah, she's in the States, right? Yeah. Okay, good. Deb. Um, so yeah, you get paint. Deb Shu, you got, you won the first night, didn't you? Was it Deb uh, that won the first night? It was Deb that won the first night. I don't remember It was a Deb. No, but, but I can't remember her last name. Was it Deb Shu? No, I, I think it was a different last name. Uh, what will those sounds look? What will they think those sounds are upstairs? I don't know. <laughs> because, yeah. That was that was course vice versa back. too, right? Yes. <laughs> Shh. You guys should all be in bed. You're bad for being up, and I'm gonna tell your mom. <laughs> all right, guys. We're gonna right. let the neighbors sleep. <laughs> yeah, We're Lori. Gonna go home. Yeah, Lori, you know the deal. Just message us. We got gotcha, you, okay? Yeah, you're right, Kelly. We'll see you at 5.30 tomorrow morning. <laughs> so, anyway. I'll be sleeping. Good night, guys. All right, see you tomorrow. See It'll be ya. day 16 tomorrow, right? Yes. We've got a whole new project, and I'm going to show you Hi, part Anna, Banana. Two Your sister's on this like Anna, what the heck are She's you doing on this way? Night shift. Are you working night shift? I bet you she is. Oh. Yeah. All right, I'll talk to you guys later. All right, see you guys. See ya. Thanks for watching.